if i vector and j vector are unit vector along x axis and y axis respectively prove that i vector square equals to 1 b j square vector equals to 1 i vector dot j vector equals to 0 j vector dot i vector equals to 0 this problem is related to the scalar multiplication of two vectors as we know if vector a and vector b are two vectors then scalar product of two vector is given by a dot b equals to magnitude of vector a into magnitude of vector b into cos and the angle between these two vectors a and b that is theta we use this concept to find or to prove that i vector square equals to 1 and the given one solution here it is given that i vector is unit vector it means that magnitude of i will be 1 j will be 1 and i is along x axis and y is along j axis that is let's draw a figure it's x axis y axis if that the unit one unit descent means from origin to this is i vector from origin to this it's j vector it's clear that for j vector the angle between um, j vector and j vector will be zero and for i vector angle between them will be zero and for i and j angle between them will be 90 degree for i vector is square equals to 1 magnitude of i is 1 and angle between them is 0 degree as i and i means is the same vector angle between the same vector is 0 by the definition of by the definition of scalar product that is i vector is square can be written as i vector into i vector now it see the formula for two vector is then it means that for i and i it can be represented i vector into i vector into cos theta degree i means one magnitude of i is vector is one magnitude of i vector is one into cos theta is cos zero degree it's one into cos zero means one one into one therefore i vector square equals to one is proved similarly for b for j vector square equals to one it's similar to this as i square vector equals to one that is magnitude of j vector is one and angle between them is also zero degree by the definition of scalar product what we can write j vector square equals to j vector into j vector it can be written as j vector into j vector into cos theta j means 1 j means 1 magnitude of j is 1 cos 0 degree is 1 into cos 0 is 1 1 into 1 equals to 1 therefore j vector square equals to 1 this also proved next one is for j vector dot i vector equals to 0 j vector means it's unit vector it's magnitude 1 for i vector is magnitude 1 angle between j and i see the j and i is 90 degree by the definition of scalar product what you can write j vector dot i vector equals to magnitude of j vector into magnitude of i vector into cos 
angle between them main root of j is 1 i is also 1 cos 90 degree it's cos 90 degree means is 0 1 into 0 is 0 therefore j vector dot i vector equals to 0 is proved lastly for i vector dot j vector equals to 0 magnitude of i is 1 magnitude of j is also 1 angle between j i j and i is 90 degree now by the definition of scalar product i dot j is given by magnitude of i into magnitude of j into cos angle between them magnitude of i is 1 magnitude of j is 1 cos theta means 90 degree can return as 1 into cos 90 is 0 0 therefore i vector dot j vector equals to 0 so in this way for unit vector along x axis i vector and unit vector along y axis j vector for the two vector i vector square equals to 1 j vector square equals to 1 i dot j is 0 j dot i equals to 0 means the scalar product of same unit vector along x axis is 1 as well as y, y axis also 1 and the scalar product of unit vector along x axis to y axis or y axis to x axis is 0